Okay, guys, I'm going to show you a trick with a normal deck of cards, okay? To prove it's a normal deck, I want Shane to go ahead, take a look at it, Shane, and even go ahead and shuffle it up. Mix up the order so it's a completely random deck, and I have no idea what order the cards are in. Really mix them up good. Perfect, okay? All right, now, so you mixed up this deck, complete random order. What I'm going to do is I'm going to take all these cards behind my back, and I'm going to try and predict what card is on the deck, top of the deck. Are you ready? Mm -hmm. I'm picturing the first card is the King of Hearts. Mm -hmm. I'm predicting the next card is the Five of Hearts. Mm -hmm. I'm predicting the next card is the Four of Hearts. The next card is the three of hearts. The next card is the six of hearts. Oh. I'm having trouble with this next card. I think it's the joker. Oh. What? This doesn't make sense. The next card's a joker too. Mm -hmm. And the next card is a seven of diamonds. I call that... Mind reading cards. This trick. is how you do it, guys. Okay? You just need an ordinary deck. Okay? Very simple trick. You can have someone shuffle up the deck before the trick. It doesn't matter, okay? All you have to do is you have to get a glimpse of that bottom card, okay? So once they shuffle it to you, just you can go through the deck and go, look, all the cards are mixed up pretty good, okay? Rick could even say, hey, I'm going to try and memorize all the cards really quick. No one will believe that you could do that. So I know the bottom card is a jack of hearts, right? I'm going to put that behind my back. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to take the jack of hearts and put that on the front like that. Okay? So I'm doing this behind my back. I'm taking the bottom card, I'm flipping it around, and I'm putting it on top of the deck. Okay? So this is what it looks like right here. Sliding it and putting it on. So I know it's a jack of hearts. So I'm saying I'm picturing this first card is the jack of hearts. So I show it to you. Now, as I'm showing it to you, I casually look at this card right here, the Jack of Spades. Oh. You get it now, Carlos? Okay. I get it. You get it? Oh, so okay. You it. But you don't go like this. Okay? <laughs> Just casually look at it as you're showing it to him, okay? So I know that next card's the Jack of Spades. So what am I going to do? I'm going to take that card, flip it over, and put it on top. So I know the next card is the Jack of Spades. Then I show it to you, and what am I doing as I'm showing you the cards? Looking at the card under that. You're right. Okay. And that one's a two of diamonds. So I put it behind my back, and you can just keep on doing it until they're bored or not amazed anymore. <laughs> Everybody understand? This trick is called mind reading cards. Now, I need somebody to shuffle up Me! Cards. Me! Me! Okay, Mr. Magic Guy. There we go. Okay. Is that good enough? Um, yeah. Okay, here you go. All right. Now, let me see. I think the next... I think the first card is... the Nine of Diamonds. Whoa! Nine. How did he do, How did he that? do that? I think... The next card is... No way you'll be able to tell. The Ten of Diamonds. What the? <laughs> no way you'll be able to do it again. <laughs> you think so? No. No, no. no way. Not the possible. The next card is... Not even close to the Eight of Diamonds. What? 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 I don't know. No, no. That just nine, ain't nine, human. I think the next I one, one is um, sort of foolish. The Jack of Diamonds? All right, good job. Okay.